Buen día, this is Roman Barba speaking. I am a Theolite Packer engineer working with HP Latex Printers. Today, in this video, we are going to talk about canvas and specifically about the possibilities of canvas when printed with HP Latex printing technologies. When I refer to possibilities, I refer to the big amount of canvases that you can print with latex technology, but also to all the different ways that we have to present a canvas. Let's start talking about materials. This is the typical canvas to be used when printing in large format. It's a canvas made of a fabric, a fabric that is usually made of cotton and polyester, although it can be made also of just cotton or just polyester. This canvas is usually coated with a gesso coating. It's a white coating that gives the smoothness to the media. And then there is an inkjet coating on top of that to give better colors, to give more saturation. Latex can not only work with this type of inkjet coated canvases, latex can also work with canvases like this one over here. This canvas has just the fabric and the gesso coating. There is no inkjet coating and therefore it's a canvas that is cheaper. It's kind of a 30% cheaper than the first ones. With latex, we can also print with fabrics that have no coating, no gesso coating, no inkjet coating, like this one over here. This is a 100% cotton fabric that we can print with latex, ink stays on the surface. As opposed to other technologies like solvent that the ink goes through the material and therefore cannot print on uncoated material, latex can and can give us such great quality on applications like this one that gives this nice rustic appearance. In any of these materials, we can add a 3D effect. Thanks to the fact that latex inks are water fast, we can add a texturizer and get a 3D effect on uh, images like this one. Usually you would do that on an art image. We would apply uh, gel like this one, we would apply with a brush, with a brush strokes, and very quickly, in a matter of minutes, you have this nice effect with this 3D that changes completely the appearance of the material. Now, let's take a look on how can we present a canvas to our customer. The typical way to present a canvas to our customer is a stretch. A stretch onto a stretcher bars in a way like this one over here. Usually, we would have a frame around that. That's what we call museum wrap style. We can also stretch a canvas onto thicker stretcher bars like this one over here. And in this case, we would hang that on the wall without any frame and that would look really very elegant. And if you want to stretch a really wide canvas, you would need uh, wider stretcher bars or even you would put two stretcher bars together. That would give us a very nice impressive canvas. And this is how a wide canvas would look like when stretched onto really thick stretch bars. And you may also be interested in splitting a wide canvas into pieces. With the help of HP Wallard, we can do that very easily and have a display like the one you can see. One great advantage of stretching a canvas printed with latex inks is that latex inks are flexible and therefore when we fold the canvas to the corners there is no cracking on the sides. And if you want to be original you can also stretch a canvas onto round stretcher bars like this one over here. This size or even bigger. Another way to present a canvas is mounted, mounted onto a rigid substrate like this MDF. We can also mount it onto a very light material, cardboard, and have this light canvas. How we do that? We just get our pre-adhesivated uh, cardboard, we remove the liner, we stick the canvas on top of that, we fold it, and there we go with our light canvas. We can also mount canvas onto cardboard to have book covers, like this one over here, very elegant one. It's a very nice way to have elegant covers with canvas. We can also mount canvas onto walls. There are many, many media vendors that offer to us canvases ready to receive the glue on the back side and a stick on the wall. Glue, like this one over here. And if we want to be very creative, there are also canvases that can be stick on the wall with a magnetic effect. So we just need a magnet on the wall. These canvases, they come already with this ferrita coating and the ferrita coating is attracted by the wall so that we can install it very easily, we can remove it also very easily. And in fact, we can even have layers. When we use this canvas with the ferrita coating, we can put one layer on top of the other. Another way to present a canvas is a hanging canvas. 
And remember, Litex can also print on uncoated canvas. So why not try to print on the back side and have this double-sided canvas? So this would allow us to have two campaigns in the same canvas. We have seen a lot of possibilities when using HP latex printing technologies when printing on canvas. We have seen that latex can work with a lot of different types of canvases and we have also seen that we can present a canvas in many different ways. Hopefully all that information was useful to you. Have a great day!